Hello again everyone, it is Vince Shoot here from Shoot Multimedia coming to you today from all of in Pennsylvania once again as I so often do for third Thursday here in June on a very warm but sunny day and there's a train behind me and some other things. You want to check them out? Let's go. That's the nice thing about having your own train station. Periodically, you get a train. Especially when Steamtown's so close by. Well, who do we have here today? Uh, my name is Dominic, and I'm the uh, locomotive engineer. I'm Brian, I'm the fireman. You guys realize that like, you are every kid's dream. At some point, every kid has a dream. Oh, yeah. To, to, to do this, exactly this. Those kids included us. Yes. Both volunteers up to a point. Brian is now an employee, but we love trains. Yeah, living the dream. Is it still living the dream when it's this warm? Thank you so much for today, guys. Oh, thank you. People love you guys. This is how it is. Yep. Yeah, we're very, we're very fond of all the towns here on the Carpenter Line. We know there's a lot of nice communities. And we want to be able to work together with you guys. So we can make money and you can make money. Oh, sure. Now, is it a little bit tougher running in the heat today, or is that always that hot? It's, it's hot, but it's part of the job. You, know, you, have to, you have some things to do to protect yourself, and you can manage it. Yeah. But definitely you have to be hardy. There's no question. You know, this isn't. Yeah. But you guys are, so that's all good. But keep in mind, in 1925, there was guys doing this for maybe uh, $2 an hour, supporting a family doing that, working maybe eight days, seven days a week. Oh, sure, working, you know, tower day, all day long and sometimes all night. And in the winter when it was 20 degrees outside, so it's an outdoor job. And this was the, this was the way stuff got around. That was that was just it. There was no other option. This is the beginning of the industrial revolution. The first machine. That's it. Amazing. Well, guys, listen. I'm not gonna hold you too much because I think it's starting to puff. So that means it needs attention. They need a lot of attention, I guess. Yeah. Oh yeah. But thank you so much for your time. Thank you for doing this and and letting every all of us who don't get to wear those hats that the latest partake it and share in the dream. It's our Thank you so much. And now we have this beautiful addition to Oliphant. We have a very own fountain. And don't forget that's coming up. Well, who do we have here today? This is Michelle Kudrick. Hi, Michelle. I do watercolor on slate. On slate? Those are slate. 150 year old slate. Wow. Yeah. Well, that's got to have some unique challenges. I mean, I don't imagine sleep absorbs watercolor very well. No, you have to put gesso on first. It's a lot of effort to that. It's very beautiful. Some very beautiful artwork you have going on here. Thank you. Now, let's say someone's not here today. Where would you normally find you so that if they wanted to get some of your wonderful artwork? Um, I have a lot of stuff on Instagram. Instagram, very good. You know, what's your Instagram handle? Um, Kudrich J. What is it? Kudrich J. Could you spell that for me? K-U-D-R-I-C-H-J. Okay, very cool. You know, there's a lot of different ways you could go with that. I, mean, I figured there might have been like a Z in there someplace, oh, no. you know, but it's... <laughs> <laughs> but very cool, could you, as, as it said as it's, uh, it's spelled as it sounds. Okay, yeah. very cool. Yeah. Well, that's easier. We'll put that up here, woof, <laughs> so that people can see it and they can check out your Instagram. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. Thank you.
looks like we got food. Yum yum. Mm. Food. And food. Ah, very cool. <laughs> yeah. I'm well, Nelson. I'm from High Seas Aerial, and uh, I'm here today selling my stuff for uh, my aerial photography and my my astrophotography. That's very cool. You have to have a lot of wild gear for that. I have. Yeah, I've gotten a lot of. I've got like seven drones. And, uh, nice. Some big, long, big, big lenses and things. No, no minor amount of skill involved with any of that. A little bit. <laughs> there's, there's, there's some skill involved. I, I, it's, 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 it's experience. It's experience more than skill. Well, the skill comes with experience. That's exactly right. right. But uh, I can say the work is beautiful. Well, thank you. And I they, learn a lot. Like with that, that's uh, like that's five minutes worth of, of, of exposure. Five minutes of exposure. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Did you have it on a tracker? Yeah. I have a tracker, and it was like thirty pictures. Oh wow! It's so hard to get that without the lines all. Well, that's it. Yeah, you got to get it all set up correctly with the with the, with the tracker. That's that's one of those things I've always wanted to do and never pulled off. But thank you so much for sharing your your artistic sure. skill with us here today in all of it. Thank you very much. Uh, if, if are, do you sell your stuff online or anything or? I've tried. I have a couple. I have, I have a website. Oh, what's your website? It's highseasarial.com. Woof, we'll put that up on the screen. High seas, high seas. High seas aerial. Stuff. Okay. But it's aerial, so it's A E R I A I A L. Aerial. Okay. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too.